Campfire USA celebrates a milestone in 2010. It is one of America's oldest and leading youth organizations. The festivities kicked off with the lighting of the traditional Wohilo fire. This is the 100th birthday celebration of Campfire USA, celebrated all across the nation at the exact same time. Today we are here with the Orange County Council at our celebration here at the OC Fair. My history with Campfire USA goes back to when I was a young girl and living in Eugene, Oregon. I used to go to Campfire Camp at Camp Wolani in Veneta, Oregon, and I went for five summers. And while I was at Campfire Camp, I learned how to set up a tent, I learned how to ride a horse and paddle a canoe and shoot an archery bow and tie a square knot and all kinds of things like that. But mostly what I learned was how to be independent and how to go and be away from my parents and have new adventures and meet new people. And that's really what I've taken away for the rest of my life. As the first non-sectarian organization for girls in the United States, to provide teenage girls with opportunities to enjoy outdoor activities and to find pleasure in new challenges. Dr. and Mrs. Gulick chose the name Campfire as a symbol of fire because campfires were the origin of the first communities and domestic life. In their words, fire symbolized the home, the place of comfort and cheer. The fire is the center of the home and its activities. Today, Campfire USA's logo of flames symbolizes fires as the center of the heart and the community. Well, I went to camp this last summer and it was a great experience for me because I got to learn new things that I didn't. For example, canoeing, and I got to eat s'mores, which I didn't know what were s'mores. Uh, what I liked the most at camp was that I got to see what the quote means. Today's kids, tomorrow's leaders. My best memory of Campfire is being in a group with seven other girls. We started as bluebirds, and I have wonderful memories of the friendships that I made, and also the good things that we did for other people. Our Campfire Girl leader was wonderful. We did crafts, and one of my best memories is making stuffed animals to take to children who were in hospital. I've got my marshmallows. I'm headed home to make some s'mores, which I remember from Campfire Girls, from the 100th anniversary celebration of Campfire USA in Orange County. This is Linda Evenoff reporting for Around and About Orange County News. Here we are together, together, together.